Uh, I'm Garrett Bergner, Director of Campus Recreation. Today we're going to go walk through the campus and uh, let you all point out anything that you think we need. And if we can just go through and everybody just say their name and who they are. So. Mary Nielsen, Dean of the School of Liberal Arts. Angela Harris, Enrollment Services. John Chuen, President. Christian Beebe, Student Worker. Sarah Hedrick, Student Worker. Both sides have inside walls. I don't know, just to make it a little bit wider. And mark the entrance to the trail. Yeah. Hey, I wasn't sure where the. If you look at the. It's, it's a, if you're going up, you could stub your toe on the sidewalk if you're up on the curb there. So, Brady? I don't know what you call it. Make it smoother where that, where they're that that separated, where that line is. Yep. Even pavement. Yeah. Okay. There. I can see that. My thing is, is the same as that right there. Yeah. The little crosswalk thing between all the streets. The crosswalk. Because we had it down by the ground. Oh, we have some stuff. Yeah. That has one. Yeah, that looks really nice. Look at that crosswalk too. That's very. That's very good. The weather is even nicer today. You want good things too, Allie, right? Oh yeah. Like look at that crosswalk right there. That's very nice. That's nice, isn't it? Uh huh. My thing is, we really need crosswalks everywhere. Across there. Yeah. And even this, this part's way, really nice, that's though. That's nice, though, isn't it? It's uh huh. And it's not a barrier. With the curve. I've been able to walk backwards <laughs> even on that's that right. one. I was able to walk backwards and not worry about the curb. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I never mm -hmm. come on this side of the curb. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm already going and the bed. That's nice too. Yeah. Slows the cars down. You have to find the trash cans clean. It's better than not having a trash can though. I really like I like um a lot of trash cans because I'm constantly eating snacks. Right. And it's nice to have somewhere to, to put it. <laughs> Sidewalk. Yeah. Bike rack over there. Swimming pool there. Now it's a picnic area. Sidewalk stops right there at the ground, so yeah. Why doesn't it keep going? Keep going, so but 
sidewalk. No, we crossed cross the I have to cross the road and all that. Okay. No sidewalk that goes in the front of the school. Yeah. I mean it comes and goes, that's the well, for, I do like my walking class, and you know we walk around the track just over and over and over. So some days I say, okay, we're going to cross the street, get on the sidewalk, and I make them walk to Cemetery Park and back because you can get on that side of the street on the sidewalk, and it'll take you there right. the whole way and not have to cross anything. But if we had a sidewalk that went all the way around without all the other traffic, we'll go up here and cross the crosswalk. It would be nice you could come then you could walk down around over there instead of Looks like a little wishful goat pass. Yeah. And I'll say this: I don't, I, I understand the whole thing out there about the between the student center and Sequoia, the, the Greenway, but that is very cumbersome to have to always walk around or. Around. I mean, well, you know how it's there's be not a new sidewalk building. straight through the Greenway there. You know how it's going to be for, for they're going to it's going to be a. Got the name too, but you walk, it's going to be an amphitheater, rampathheater, I guess they call it. And so the seats are really going to be for wheelchairs and that, so you can walk, you can get up the hill by going on a path like this. So that's going to be there, and that will be that will be helpful. Hmm. And then go through the building or around. So, and I already after that meeting made sure that we that you have a way to. Uh, find the stairs very easily in the elevator, not as easy. Yeah. Right. <laughs> so we've got that. So the stairs will be right there, inviting, well-lit pictures, everything. We already have that all taken care of. So Good. choose the stairs instead of going back behind and finding it. Those benches are very yeah, nice. Study like We're getting a benches up there. Before you actually hit the climb. Yeah. Yeah. Around there. So but we, we, we need them straight. around up at the It starts climbing there. It starts there. already at the corner and all. Yeah, when people know that they're there, they're more apt to take their lunch out there and walk to it. Yeah. See, look, there's some people over there sitting at those benches. Very inviting. It's a nice little pleasant area here. The bell tower. Yeah. I think they need that. Uh, I think it's, I like the, the walking. It's it's pretty, and I think most of us pretty comfortable, so I like that. But sure. we're not as friendly as we could be. To I like it. the trees and the flowering shrubs and the being able to look up at the ridge. Yeah. About. I, think, I think we were all in agreement that the interior seems to be pretty nice. Oh, yeah. It would be nice to have, like we said, some signage maybe that said the types of trees or types of bushes that we have on campus. Kind of an educational lesson as well. What about um, infrastructure-wise? What would you kind of see? Would, what was attractive, not attractive? It would be nice to have more lighting and all, on that one sidewalk instead of right here on this little short strip and all just go all the way around. As students, do you think that make, well, wouldn't make other people feel more safe? Because you all probably feel safe, but, you know. But I guess it kind of beats coming through this dark area at night or something. Coming through the woods. Yeah. Kind of, yeah. yeah. I mean, because we do. I have two that work for me that usually close the gym at 10 o'clock that live in the apartments. And mm -hmm. I'll check with them to see which way they, because most of the time they walk home mm -hmm. and I don't know if they walk down through the middle or if they walk the outside but I'll need to check with them and see what they say about lighting yeah. whichever yeah, way they idea. happen yeah. to walk. So, yeah. Well um, great anything else you guys have to add? I think if some of the sidewalks could be a little smoother. Yeah great. So some of the gradient on the sidewalks. Did you guys have fun today? Yeah. It was so fun wasn't it? Yes, so we're not done. We're not done. <laughs> Thank you. And there's a nice area up here where it's 
it's an herb garden. Mm -hmm. and, oh. they, and you, it's generally labeled. So uh, for a while I was eating the parsley. <laughs> and then there's some spearmint growing. Mm. And I know they had dill in there at one yeah. time and oregano and all kinds of stuff. But yeah, see it does have sage. Here's where the Rampa Theater is going to be. Where you, it will, it'll be wheelchair accessible to get up the hill instead of having to go back up there. And then um, you could also sit and do, there'll be a stage down here sort of, and uh, you can do lots of different external things down here. And then the building will be up where the people are. So it will take away from the fitness trail. You'll have to start elsewhere. Uh, well, see, the fitness trail cuts right through. May have to. Right there. I bet you're right. Yes. Then there'll be a couple of trees that are going to be cut. What down. about the greenhouse? That's going to be moved. We, we, we're going to move it anyway and, and put it It's uh, in a more. Actually, I think it's going to be on the other side of Sequoia so it gets sun. Over there? No, that. Uh, I'm sorry. On the other side of the, the new building. building. I meant to say. It'll be between the gym and the new building. Yes, yeah, I think so. And there's a. Nice art, some nice artificial ponds down there. Yeah. Nice little bridge. Right, There's a little back pond back there. Mm -hmm. back two, okay. two little right, ponds. Oh. And a, a nice little, uh, yeah, bridge. I've been back there before to run. It's nice to have a little bit of trails to run on as opposed to sidewalks. This is the return of it? Yeah, because when you started, you were up there and cut it across. And when you come back, you come back this way. down here. I mean, you're away from everything else, and it would be nice to have a water fountain or restroom yeah. facility down here. That's the tennis courts and track down there. You can see through the trees, a bunch of students playing. It's a big open field. How long is that track that goes around? 0.38 miles. Okay. I saw on your website, y'all had it listed as 0.3. Oh, it's a 0.38. Yeah. Okay. And I tell my class it's just 0.4. Yeah. I figure by the time you park your car and walk there, I mean, when you we walk that, through um, our classes, I just say four tenths of a mile is each lap. So yeah. about two and a half is a mile. But there's no signage that says that. Oh. And so some signage on the track. I mean, it is not a typical track surface. And I think that is also something that would need to be like looked at whenever they redid. But yeah, that a little more spongy. I do too. I will look at that. I wonder if somehow, because sometimes when I run the loop, if you can make some sort of area to cross the street and connect that track. Sometimes when I want to increase my mileage, it's nice. Walk. Yeah, crosswalk yeah. for even for non-students right. to use that. Yeah. Just somewhere safe where they know to 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 cross. But I know when we do our walking class, we always meet here at the at the hut. And then the days I have them walk over there, we walk right there and go across, but that would be nice to have a yeah. crosswalk. Yeah, it might even be nice to have a sign there to where people that are running the loop, if they know Dalton right. State's got this, they might head on over. Even the fitness trail, because I didn't know it was there until I just came over to use this track. And then I saw this that trail that's not even paved, which is nice because it makes you feel like you're in the, in the woods. So that might be nice just to have a sign on that side of the loop 
that says cross here if you want to use that.